Michael Massamy is the invasive species and marine programs coordinator for the Barataria Terrebonne National Estuary Program. He says this South American apple snail was most likely bought for home aquariums, then dumped, free to reproduce, and boy, have they. Each egg mass can hatch as many as a thousand tiny apple snails that grow to be as big as an apple, and they cause damage to our land, eating aquatic plants, affecting the ecosystem. Then it gets muddy and turbid and, and sunlight doesn't penetrate. There's a lot of al algal growth. So instead of a healthy water body that's good for fisheries. So far, there's no specific way to control them that won't also harm the water and wildlife like crawfish. But there may be some help from this bird. There's a, a new species of predator of apple snails called the limpkin. That might actually make some bit of impact on this population. While leftover shells can make a great costume, 